Hi everybody, Bob with Knives Town here. Today we're looking at a knife uh, by Boker. It's actually a Boker Magnum knife. And I've said before that I really appreciate the value that the Magnum line represents. It is the um, the affordable, uh, cost-effective, value-oriented line of knives that Boker puts out. And I've said before, you get a whole lot of knife for the money. And this one is uh, another good example of that. This is the Boker Elk Hunter uh, by uh, Boker Magnum Elk Hunter. And it is a fixed blade knife. Uh, it arrives in this box with uh, the sheath. You get a, a, a brown leather sheath with the knife. The knife arrives in tissue paper. And the blade has a paper sleeve on it. There we go. There you go. That's an attractive looking knife. Very much so. Just a quick look at the sheath first. Uh, it is a uh, just a, a basic drop-in sheath. Uh, it does have a, a snap, it has a belt loop, and uh, good stitching all around. Let's see if I can get you a close up there on that. Just nothing out of the ordinary, just a good solid leather sheath with a belt loop, riveted. Got a good heavy snap on it. And let's see what the knife looks like in there. There you go. That's what it looks like in there. And that's held in. There's a, a finger guard here that the snap wraps around so there's no way that's coming out. Alright. What we've got here is a uh, classic drop point blade which is four and a third inches long and made of 440 stainless steel. It is hollow ground and it does have a top swedge on it there. It is uh, a full tank construction, as you can see. And it's a good thickness. You can see there's a good, good thickness there of that blade. The handle is made of a combination of rosewood here and root wood here. And I think that makes a I think that makes an attractive looking knife. I like that rosewood. It's got a brass pin at the rosewood and then silver pins on the root wood. There's a lanyard hole with a brass ring insert. That's very attractive figuring there on the wood. There's the Magnum logo. got a nice shape too. You can see it's got kind of a just a slight downward drop off there. Uh, you know, and then and then a finger groove here and then a big finger guard there. So it's got it's you know, it's it's there's been attention to the grip, attention to the hold. There's attention to safety with the with the finger guard there.
that's just a just a basic straight ahead fixed blade knife and uh, it, for the for the price this is the price on this knife is extremely uh, extremely affordable it could it could be could be had within just with anybody's budget you get a good five and a half ounce knife there overall length is nine inches and you know the quality on this knife is it's it's good it is good I mean the fit and finish here is you know I'm looking at it I mean there it's there's no asymmetry uh, there's no gaps the 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 mating of the of the different scale materials is right up against it there's no there's no uh, wavering or anything their wobbliness or unevenness and uh, it's smooth straight across there is no there's no bumps or uh, unevenness there it's just you know I mean it's it's been made it's been made with some craftsmanship It's a good looking knife. Four and a third inch of blade, so that's that's plenty enough to get your your chores done. Field dressing. Comes with a sheath. It's a good kit. Alright, well thanks a lot. See you again.